What's up guys, it's Claudio here and we are at Cassana Velodrome for the Twilight Series on Wednesday night. It is such a good time. I have three races in this video. This is a scratch race. We have a points race and we have the devil scratch race at the end. You have to stick around for the devil scratch race. It is the most incredible finish ever. So excited about it. Stick around and let's get right into it. Uh, for those of you who don't know, this is a scratch race. A scratch race is really just whoever crosses the finish line first wins. And they do podium on that, or one, two, three. And this is a five lap scratch race. It's really short. These races are, you know, this race is two minutes and 40 seconds. Super punchy. I'm already eating a lot of wind. This is not good. Um, starting out kind of a high heart rate. And what does it say? Four laps to go. So this is, um, you know, track is really punchy, really short. Um, it's totally different from road, which is what I like. I really like this. Um, it's exciting and it, it's extremely strategic. Okay, I'm, I'm doing, I'm, I'm using really bad strategy here. It's the first race of my day. And finally, I get some shelter here and I'm feeling out the field. This is a, they broke it down into an A field and the B field. I'm in the B field. And it's a bunch of people here, maybe, I don't know, 15. That's a lot for a field here. And so we have Cat 5s, Cat 4 racers. I don't know if maybe Cat 3s in here, but definitely some experienced Cat 4s. So we have a little bit of a, of a separation here. I have to close everything down. And um, you can see my gearing is, uh, what is it, 51, 15. And that's fine. I like it. I like it a lot for this. It gives me some uh, punchy attack and it allows me to close gaps quickly. I don't want to close that gap. That's for sure. Um, I'm trying to, to let people close it. I'm trying to feel out the field. Um, it's the first race, so it's kind of like uh, the warm up. But I really should be uh, working hard here to do something. I get, again, I was just kind of calibrating my senses here to see uh, who was in the field and everything. But um, they have Omnium points, so every race, you know, they score it, they get points, and then at the end, um, you get a winner for the day, and then you get a winner for the whole series. I believe there's four dates in August on Wednesday. So come out on Wednesday, Wednesday night. You can be a total beginner. And they'll do a little clinic for you. I think this is a, is this final lap? I'm boxed in. There's no, this is bad. Yeah, there's nothing happening for me here. I have to move up. I have to do something. I have to go around. I have to squeeze in. It's getting sketchy. Let's see what happens. Where's my sprint? Do I do anything? I mean, the race is gone. One, two, three is up there. And what do I have left? Can I get some points here? I don't. Uh, pretty straightforward race. And now we're into the points race. So, man, I forgot how many laps this was. I'll, I'll figure it out right now. Oh, nine laps. Nine laps points, so there's, like, every other lap or every three laps, there's a sprint, and whoever wins the sprint, they get points. They score, like, the first two or the first three. And then the final sprint on the last lap, that's, uh, I think they give them more points to that. I'm not clear about the whole point system. I'm still new, so I am just trying to get in there and do stuff. Uh, I'm figuring out the tactics as I go along. Here, do you want to waste yourself at the beginning? Do you want to go for a late attack? Do you want to counterattack a sprint that just happened? That's a thing. And this is a, a nine lap, uh, nine lap race, and it ended up being four minutes and 55 seconds after the neutral start. So again, this is like short racing, and you gotta be able to really pace yourself because uh, these are high efforts. I mean, look, we're doing 500, 400 watts. I'm surging a lot. I'm getting gapped already. What's happening? I gotta get back up there. And you can see there's already people up there sprinting. They are sprinting for that first sprint points system. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not messing around with that one. I wanna go for a later one. And uh, did they score this? I don't know if they scored this. They might've scored that one. Again, when you're new, you don't really know anything about the, these point systems. So you're just kind of cruising along, but there is a lot of strategy. Um, I don't know it all. I'm definitely figuring it out. And they are, there's a little group up there. They're going for that podium. One, two, three, 
the points. I'm trying to squeeze in and I call the inside there. I'm just trying not to get dropped. I need to be in there. Okay, I think they scored that one. And now they're slowing down up there. And I've got momentum here. All right, let's go. So now I'm in this little chase group, getting to the front. And I want to, I really want to counter them. I, I want to counter attack them so bad. But I don't want to blow myself up. They're still kind of far up. And I think they're going up for um, another sprint. I call the inside there going 28 miles an hour. Not bad. And I still got, I got an effort in me. I don't know if they scored that one. No, I don't think they scored one. Um, but they're, they're gassed up there. These two guys, they have been through it. And I believe they're going to score the next one. So we want to snag that. This guy totally wants to snag it. I'm on his wheel. And let's see what do we do here. How are we going to sprint through these guys? How are we going to snag these uh, next points? Let's go. Let's go. Is there a sprint? No, this is not the sprint lap. Okay. Or maybe it is. Maybe it's on the next one. Man, I really don't know. <laughs> it's hard keeping track. When you're a beginner, you're, you don't really, it's, you're just there trying not to die, basically, and not to get dropped. Okay, this looks like a sprint lap right here. Is it going to work? Are we going to do something? Um, you want to, you want to stay sheltered? You want to really, you have like, you know, I have just a couple of matches. This is it. This is a sprint lap. Obviously, we're going for it. And there I am. And do I grab it? Yes, nobody, nobody catches me. I got the points there. Nice. And I'm in the lead. I'm at the top of the race. That's me, these are lapped riders. And now we have separation. So we could potentially get that next sprint two laps from now. And this guy's telling me we have a gap. We gotta stay on it. We gotta keep pushing. I'm kind of, uh, I'm kind of gassed here, but I'm feeling good. I'm really not looking back. I don't think I've ever looked back in, in track. I just, I'm not confident with that. I don't want to veer off and, and, and wreck. Uh, what do we have here? Two laps to go. Two laps to go and we have a gap and uh, we start to rotate. This is the way to do it. He gaps me a little bit, but I have that nice gear that it really allows me to, to close gaps. I start to spin out at around like uh, 32 miles an hour which is totally fine. Uh, the B field does not get too far above 30 miles an hour. So, I mean, only in the sprints. So it's all good. My gearing, it's great for this. Um, I could go 52.15 and I've had that one lap to go. 52.15 is kind of a little bit of a grind for me. I don't have that kind of strength, but it's totally doable. And I attack the guy. You see that? I, I attack him and I gap him. That was intentional. I wanted to get up there. Now he's doing the same amount of work that I'm doing because he's not in my draft. And eventually, does he get in my draft? Yes. So now he's saving some watts, but I'm at the advantage because I'm in the inside. So he has to go around to out sprint me. Does he have the legs? And what do I have left? 900 watts. Is it enough? Oh no, he beats me right at the line. But I snagged some points in there. I don't know how many, but I've got some good points racked up. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Devil Scratch Race, the final race of the day. It's the third flight for the B field, and this is a fun race. I'm, I'm going to explain it here. The first six laps, it's elimination. It's an elimination race, so the last person crossing the line is out. They do that for six laps, so six people get out, and there's a ton of people in this. Um, maybe even close to 20, over 20. Six people are out, and then it turns into a four-lap scratch race. So whoever wins after those four laps, that's it. That's the podium. One, two, three. So the strategy here, I actually had strategy on this one. I'm really proud of it. My strategy is stay in the top five during the elimination portion of the race and to not burn any matches, so no surging, um, which happens when you're in the back of the elimination because you're constantly... Uh, sprinting to go around people to save yourself but if you're in the front of the elimination even if you're doing threshold or something kind of hard it's way better than having to sprint every lap way better 
that sprinting will kill you. And then at the end, when we have that scratch race, the scratch portion, it's uh, you're done. You have no sprint. So let's see how high I get into the watts. I think I keep it under 400 watts the whole time during the elimination, which is great. I'm just sucking wheels. I'm not doing anything. I'm not surging. And that was my strategy. No surging here. Uh, trying to keep it uh, keep it easy. I don't have my Garmin on me, by the way. You can't look at your watts. You can't do anything. You have to put it in your pocket or put tape over it. They don't let you do the Garmin thing um, and track because it's just not safe. So I'm just sitting there. I'm sitting in, not worrying because um, I know there's a lot of people. As long as I have, I'm in the top five or six or so, um, that's the way to go. And I don't want to be boxed in. You see the inside? That's the worst place because those guys can't get out and you get boxed in. So I want it to be on the outside towards the front. It's the safest. And I'm doing a, a nice effort here. I'm just, I'm cruising. My heart rate is nice and recovered. And now we have an attack. An attack in the an elimination portion. Man, look at that guy go. He gets huge separation. People are like, we're not chasing that. It's still so early. This guy has guts to do that. It's the elimination part, but he knows. He's thinking ahead of the scratch race, right? And that's his tactic. He's already have, you know, he's up there. We're not chasing him. We are just thinking about the elimination portion. And I'm sitting in. I'm not worried about that guy. I'm thinking that he's going to die off or I don't know what's happening, really. So we're cruising along 22 miles an hour, 23. No big deal. But man, the guy's moving up there. He's getting some separation, and I think some guys here are starting to chase. They're starting to get worried because they're thinking of, uh, you know, later on in the race, in like a couple of minutes. By the way, this race lasted six minutes after the, the neutral. Now we're speeding up here. I had to put in a little dig. Um, let's see. The, the average power, for example, is 251 on this one. Normalized power, 287. Average speed, 26.3. Um... So those are the stats, man. This is still a short race, a six minute race, right? It's nothing. And the guy's still up the front. He's really going for it. He's putting an effort in there. He must be going, uh, you know, at least 25, 26 miles an hour. He's doing a solid effort. We're just sitting in. Um, and let's see how many laps, what, what do we have now? And that's it, the scratch race has started. And you can see the tempo is going up. And we're going up there. We're starting to ramp it up. And let's see what I'm boxed in here. This is not good, but I'm sheltered. It's no big deal. The guy, look at the guy. He's way up there. We have some ground to make up. And I'm fresh, guys. I am fresh. My legs are good. Good to go. Now we have all this surging. Maybe the scratch race starts right here, I believe. Let me see. This is it, four laps to go. This is the beginning of the scratch race and there's separation right away. And I have to close this. This is the race right here. I have to bridge this because look at the gap behind me. I mean, that's it, it's done. I know that I need to close this. I need to be with the front group and this is the race. This is the only chance that we have. And now we have to catch this guy. We have to make an effort as a group to rotate and this guy's yelling at everybody. Uh, people don't, people, we're not really organized yet. This guy's um, getting kind of uh, annoyed, but we, we, we get it together. Here it is, now we start our pulls. We have, um, what, three laps to go? And we gotta catch this guy, we have to do it. This is it, this is the race. He's right there. We're making up ground. And we gotta rotate. And we gotta do like half lap pulls. And we'll catch him. Oh, there's a little bit of a gap up there. Come on, Red. Close the gap. What do we have here? Two laps to go. Okay, he's right there. We got him. We got him. We got to close this. Come on, Red. Push. Guys, I am fresh. I am still fresh. I made that effort to bridge, but I didn't burn my match. I did not burn any sprint matches. He's asking me to pull through. Okay, it's my turn. Let's see what I can do here. Zero watts. 
Okay, come on. Oh, all right. Uh, what do I get up to? Okay, 300. It's above threshold. And one lap to go. Here we go. I'm doing 300, but I pull off to the side. And guys, this is my strategy. We have one lap to go. I go up the bank. And I use the momentum. And I, there's my match right there. I got one match. And I hammer it. I use the banking. I go hard. I go all in. We have half a lap to go. Do I chase him? Do I chase him down? Do I have it in me? I'm going 31. I went 33 miles an hour. I've got the speed. I've got the momentum. Do I catch him? Let's go. One more. And I got him right at the line. Let's go. Wow, that was so exciting. Guys, this is that was like one of my best moments ever. I'm so happy about it. Everybody high-fived me. It was awesome. It felt so good to finally do something strategic. It wasn't luck. I really planned that out. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Subscribe for more content like this. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.